Hey guys, this is Shay from Skull Gaming Network. Welcome to another video, and today I'm going to tell you guys how you can play season mode games or simulate them like I do on a computer using emulators. Now, this video isn't necessarily new or fancy or exciting, but I feel like there might be people out there who don't know how emulators work, so I'm briefly going to explain what they are, and then I'm going to show two great options that I've used and I can personally attest to have worked and been good for me in terms of using them to simulate season games and get more rewards in MLB Perfect Inning 2018. So basically what an emulator is, these are both Android emulators I'm going to show you. It basically makes a mobile device setting on a computer, either a laptop or a desktop should work. And then from that mobile environment, you're able to download mobile games, mobile apps, and then you can control them with a trackpad or a mouse. And some apps have it where you can customize keyboard controls. So certainly you can play a lot of games using these emulators. So you'd be playing mobile games on a computer. Might not seem to be the most productive in a lot of cases, but for MLB Perfect Inning 2018, certainly being able to simulate games using these emulators. Your PCs are built to run more complex things than a mobile device, so it won't slow your computer down as much as your phone. The battery drain won't be as bad, both short and long term, on a computer as it would be on a mobile device. And the speed is about the same on an emulator versus an actual mobile device. If you have any more questions on that part, you can ask me in the comments. But now I'm going to show the two options that I've used. Certainly there are always risks involved, but I would say having used both these emulators, they are generally pretty safe and you can go elsewhere on YouTube and find reviews that will say the same thing, that there's always risks involved, but these emulators both should be good. The first one is only for PC. It is called Knox Player. So how it works, you download it, and then you open it up. Once you open it up, you can go to the Google Play Store, download Perfect Inning 2018, or just about any other game or app you would want to use, and then you're good to go. Now, some apps might require you to root Knox. It's not too hard. You just go on the settings, you click on root, and then you restart it. I'll link to the video that I used to figure out how to root Knox Player in the description of this video. It's really not too hard, and that just links the emulator to your PC. So kind of like how an Android operating system would link to a specific phone or an iOS operating system links to a specific phone or tablet or other device, by linking the Android and routing it to the computer, it kind of, in a dummy de facto way, treats it as its own mobile device. And the second one, this one works for both Windows and Mac. So as long as you're not running Linux, this should work. And this is called BlueStacks. BlueStacks has been around for seven years now, I believe. It is a very popular and well-known emulator. And it's pretty similar to Knox. I don't know as much about rooting BlueStacks because I haven't had to root BlueStacks for anything. But it's very simple. You download it, and then you have access to the Google Play Store. You get apps through the Google Play Store, and then you can play those games or run those apps on this BlueStacks software. Not too long of a video, nothing too complex. I just wanted to let you guys know these are both out there. Once you get one, you can start season mode going for MLB. Then you can, as long as you don't completely quit out the emulator, you can hide it behind an internet browser Word documents, Excel spreadsheets, whatever else you might need for work and or school. Heck, you can even hide it behind YouTube and watch YouTube videos while these games simulate in the background. These emulators have their own audio settings, so if you don't want to hear their audio, you can mute them. You have a lot of control, and you can have these season games or whatever else you might want to have going 
you can play Battlelands Royale on these emulators if you really want to. You could probably technically play Fortnite as long as it reads as being compatible. Now, you might as well just get PC Fortnite at that point, but it is a possibility. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, found it informative and helpful. If you did, leave a like. If you're new around here, subscribe for more mobile gaming related content. My primary game is MLB Perfect Inning 2018. I also play Battlelands Royale in live streams. And then a little bit of Madden Overdrive. I haven't uploaded for a bit, but I do play that game and I certainly plan to bring it back to my channel. That being said, that's going to do it for now, guys. MG from Skull Gaming Network. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, as always, peace out.